Today we are um, we're taking uh, trees and brush and grass clippings and we're recycling it back into the ground. So we're we're literally um, uh, mulching out our grapevines. serves numerous purposes. Um, one of them is that um, it's weed control. So if we can put it on there four inches or more thick, um, the weeds don't grow through it. So we don't have to use herbicides. And that's one less chemical that, um, that most vineyards dump on the ground on a uh, bi-weekly basis. also adds so much to the soil over time uh, the earthworms break it down um, the funguses um, work hard at um, producing food that's um, that's able to be uptake uptaken by the plants um, we just um, we just believe it's a more natural way of farming than using a lot of chemicals Frank is controlling the speed of the mulcher and making sure that I have a good area of mulch to spread where it's not too thick or too thin and it's covering everything properly. Our mulching team is great. It's like a pit crew. Uh, we can do a, a cycle in about 20 minutes getting this machine completely loaded up um, and then taken out, unloaded, and uh, back again. It is hard work, um, but the fact of the matter is, is that um, once the uh, once the land's ruined, it's really hard to reclaim it and get it back. So um, we're going to work real hard at using as few of chemicals as possible, um, and we're going to work real hard at turning this um, land back over when we pass. Um, in a better shape than it was when we first got it. It's just a, a labor of love and because we enjoy farming, um, it just doesn't seem like work.